Okay, here we go. Ready? <laughs> that is amazing. That really demonstrates the speed of sound perfectly. Exactly. Let me do it again. Three, two, one. Welcome to Bangles of Theory. The show that likes to take science apart, give it a bit of a poke, and put it all back together again. Put it all back together again. What I want to do is make that bigger. Faster, stronger, and a whole load more powerful. Something that requires a shocking disregard for personal safety. I'm keen to accelerate to almost the speed of light. When I get there, things will seem pretty normal to me. One of the most tantalizing questions we can ever ask. The big question is, why is he doing this? This actually illustrates one of the most fundamental laws of the universe. The more questions you answer, find there is to investigate and the more questions you pose and that's the beauty of science welcome to the quietest room in the world so this room is a lot quieter than silence <laughs> we've got carbon and hydrogen hydrogen we've got oxygen and nitrogen A fuzzy cloud of atomless spread out over space. It may sound bonkers, but there is a good scientific reason for it, I promise. The more questions you answer, the more you find there is to investigate. And the more questions you pose, and that's the beauty of science. Let's imagine that we see something crazy, perhaps. Something that we have no expectation of, something that makes no sense. To me, that would be the most wonderful thing on earth. Oh, my life. That's astonishing. There is grandeur in this view of, view of life. From so simple a beginning, a beginning, all endless forms, you all beautiful and wonderful, have been and are being evolved. Blocks for all life on Earth came from outer space. Came from outer space. Did those same building blocks lead to life on other planets? On the bigness scale of questions, this is probably a ten. No, actually, it's more like an eleven. The more questions you answer, the more you find there is to investigate, and the more questions you pose about the beauty of science. And accelerated through here at Mach 5. What could possibly go wrong? 